Mercy back here again with another video now. I'm back to discuss something new today. It said that if you're obese as an adult, is it your fault? Okay, now look, when it comes to any kind of question like this, there's always black, white, and there's silver. I mean, there's always, there's always gray areas. There's something, there's some ex exceptions. Now, ultimately, I think it's, it's up to you. Ultimately, like 90% is up to you, okay? Now, the 10% look, if you have a proper diagnosed medical medical condition or if you're from trauma of you're suffer, still suffering from trauma then i guess it's not your fault okay i mean everyone deals with trauma differently me personally i, I deal with trauma or bad news by, by playing football or going to the gym some people some people deal with it by let's say um smoking some people deal with it by smoking weed everyone has their ways of releasing stress okay and it's not, it's not their fault but they just find that way easier to relate to some people release stress by Praying, um, um, listening to gospel music. Everyone has their own separate ways of dealing with stress. Okay, but look, it depends how you're gonna because you need to depends how you're gonna measure it. Okay, because look, he said he said obese, not overweight, not big, not fat. Obese. You don't. You have to clock what obese is. Obese, fat. Obese. Obese. It's different. Okay. Now it depends how you measure it. Okay. Me personally, I I will never use BMI to measure someone's obesity. Okay. Because number one, Africa is being is is known medically or whatever that African American people's bones are more are more denser than European bones. I don't know why genetics, but it's more denser. If you, if you even clocked, okay, when it comes to athletics, especially running and um, and endurance, it's mostly. Black, no offense, but mostly Af Afro Caribbean people that win, and it's not because they train more. White Europeans they train as well. Sometimes even at better facilities, they still train. But it's it's, it's in the DNA. We usually have more denser bones. Therefore, our bones will weigh more than their bones, and that, that's why I say that BMI is not really a good measurement. Okay, no, number one, number two, I BMI is not a good way to measure obesity. Okay, if they put me on the BMI scale, I will be obese. Cause look. I've searched up, I'm 5'11", okay, and for someone that's 5'11", okay, I'm supposed to be 9 to 12 stone. That means 136 pounds to 175 pounds. I should be 9 to 12 stone. Anything between that, that means I'm good. I'm, I'm, I'm living life well. That means I'm looking after myself, okay? But my G, I'm 101, I'm 100 kg, I'm 100 kilos, I'm 16 stones, 16.1, around 16.2 stones, okay, so if you're going to put me on the BMI, I think there's a special one for, for henchmen people, or muscular people, okay, but if you're going to put me on the, on the, on the scale, okay, on the BMI scale thing, I am one hot dog away from death, I'm like one hot dog, what, I'm dead, okay, so that by, that's why I measure, I don't know, I know it's kind of stupid, but I usually measure obesity by eyes, okay, by eyes, you can see that, yo, your big you're you're overweight you're obese you're 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 bedridden you know there's levels there's, there's levels to this thing crooked there's levels to the thing okay now is it your fault it is your fault bro okay now obviously I, I said that if it's medically then it's not your fault you have to sympathize with people you have to sympathize with people that are going through stuff or going through stuff that's that is now they're eating and they find eating to play to remove you know, to remove the stress, to relieve the stress a little bit. It's like a stress reliever. When you're eating food, you're happy. Have you, 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 you're not the same without nuts. When you're hungry, okay, if you, when you're eating, you're happy, you're, you're, you're enjoying life, okay? Now, is it your fault? Yeah, ultimately, it is your fault, okay? But you know what, yeah? Do you know what they need to consider? But whenever you have an argument, whenever you have a debate, you need to consider these four things, okay? Or I call it cage. Who clocks cage? Cage, fam. Class, did not say that? Age. Gender, ethnicity. Ethnicity is different. Um, gender, I mean, I don't know. Age, class. They didn't remember to finances. If you, look, I'm sorry, but to live a healthy lifestyle is expensive. Gym, what? That's like 20 to 40 pounds. It depends on the way you go. Flipping, um, um, what's it called? This gym, that's expensive. Healthy food is expensive. If you want to get a personal trainer, that's hella expensive. To have all these... Um, chicken scissor, uh, 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 um, cucumber pie, everything. Da -da 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 -da. It is hard. Okay, it's expensive. Now imagine you're on benefits, and because you, or if you know, if 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 you're not on benefits, but you wanna provide for your children, so you're nine to five. Okay, I have three, four children. Where is the time to lose weight? It is difficult. It is difficult, and especially age. Let's say you're 21 to 29, it's easy to lose weight. I mean, it's easy, but as you get older, it's harder and harder and harder to lose weight. But talking about class, not everyone can, it's, it's hard. To live a healthy, healthy, healthy lifestyle is hard. Flipping, a health, I, know, I know people say, but they're changing. 
fam, three apples for one pound. That's not gonna fill me up. Three apples. Yes, three apples, one pound. I'm full. Fam, one pound chicken and chips down the road. I'll be full for fam. I'm good, G. So, so it is different, okay? And I think they mentioned, okay, is flipping um, if you're being brought up in an African household that you know how it's hard, you know, how it's hard to pull out of it, you know, you you are to me, me, I was brought up in an African house, African to the bone. Where we we'll put gar rice for breakfast, gar rice for lunch, gar rice for dinner, with we'll dinner fries on top, gar rice cake. 14th birthday. What a mistake. Gar rice cake, bro. My mom actually <sighs> Sorry, let me do a quick wally. Huh. I'm, I'm joking, but why did he cry then? But yeah, and, 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 and to be honest, me, I grew up fat, okay? From at least 14 to 19, I was a fat guy. I was a big guy. I was a, fam, I was a big guy, okay? And, and that's when I clocked that, yo. I can't, I can't live my life like this. That's why, that's why I changed, okay? So yes, if an African household, I was African household from life. My dad told, 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 me, told me one time that, yo, this thing this thing called six-pack, he's never heard of it in his life. This is a new thing to him because from Africa, you know, you're supposed to be big. You're supposed to be overweight. But if, if you're a beast in Africa, you'll still be made fun of. But if you're big or overweight, because there's, there's levels to this thing, better clock it, there's, there's levels. But if you're overweight in Africa, that's fine. Oh, healthy. You are looking wealthy as well, oh. Ah, hey, you're eating well. Let me marry you. Let me marry you. But if you're obese, you'd be like, hey, you fatty. You know, Africans, there's no limit to it, okay? And and like, and to be honest, okay, what Sia said, what something that Sia said was really good, okay? She's like, yo, some people want to be, some people not want to be, but okay, want to be fat, okay? I don't know if you want to be fat. Or they, they enjoyed the fat, the, 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 when, they were, when they were fat, or when they were big, or when they were overweight. They enjoyed it, bro. And me personally, when I was fat, and when I was overweight, I didn't Enjoyed it, fam. For me, I, obviously it's just for everyone because everyone takes everything differently. But f f me being fat from fourteen to nineteen, that was a character building session. Sesh of f five five years. It built me. It built me. Okay. But obviously, if you go to secondary school, okay, and you're fat, okay, or you're big or whatever, okay, you're the biggest target. <laughs> Literally, get it? <laughs> biggest. Haha, <laughs> you are the biggest target. You are ever when someone comes to someone, when when someone eats food on the on let's say you're watching a uh you're watching a documentary, okay? When someone eats a f eats food, you'll be like, hey, mercy. Is that you, son? Hey. Even in the Lord's Prayer, that's you know these will have no respect. No one says, Our Father who art in heaven, I'll be that name, that kingdom kind of will be done. And he said, No one says go to the bread part. Someone says, Hey, mercy. Take one bread, man. Don't take two. Don't take two. We see you. Take, even in the Lord's Prayer. They were, um, and, uh, I, went, I can't remember the whole thing. I can't remember the whole thing, but after he went to heaven, I'll be and then the kingdom kind of will be done. I know the whole thing, but sorry, okay? And he, and he just said, this, we need to take our daily bread. And we'll be like, hey, mercy, take one, mate. You fire. Hey, take one. You tap you on the shoulder. Take one, mate. Take one. Do you know what you got for communion as well, okay? And you take the bread and you, um, and, and the priest drinks the wine. You know, that's in the Catholic thing, okay? or Catholic um, side of Christianity, okay? But you take the bread, okay? When you want to take the bread, you'll be like, hey, mercy, take one, mate. Take one. Take one. And that built me, okay? Now my, my now I, I feel better, okay? Now someone cussing me now, I don't feel it. Like, like oh, is that it? Because I've been, I've, I've been, Cussed to a point where I'm like, and I cussed back to this point, fam. And I, I, I've been cussed to a point where it's built me to be so much stronger. And I feel that if I had a choice to be slim in those ages, I say no. Let me be fat. Let me, let me be fat. Let me be big, okay? So it built me to who I am today. Now let's go for the character assessment of today. I think I, I think I talked about everything. Yeah. They didn't consider age. They didn't consider what obese is. BMI, I don't really count it because of African, the, the density in African people's bones, okay? And big bone, big bone, did that, 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 that's just a phrase, okay, that um, bigger people will use. I'm not fat, I'm big bone, did it? I don't know, kind of thing, okay? Let's go for character assessment, I've one done today. Nunu. I think people say that, people say that she's an actor, that she's actually paid her to be like, because sometimes something she says is really ignorant, G. Like, that's how sometimes I understand people are rude to her. She, she's really ignorant sometimes. She doesn't want to be sympathetic to some other, other people's situation. Someone could nearly die, and then that's why they, they think. She's like, yeah, that's what I thought. Why did, Nelly, why, did, why did Nelly die for? Stop it. You know what I mean? She's like, she's really... I don't know if they... And where's that Somalian girl? 
I saw this little Somalian girl in the thing. For three episodes, she's been absent. We're like, where's that Somalian girl? You know, there's a girl with her job and that. I don't, some Somali girl, sorry. Where's that Somali girl? I know she, she had a head job and stuff. Where is she, bruv? Like, fam. You need, to, you need to send her in because... And let's replace Nuni for one week at least, you know, because though, though Lucas today, there was no... um um The guy with the beard and the thing on it, there was no... There's there was, there was no, there no Omar, there's no Adrian that said, okay, Captain says, like, see her, oh, she cried, you know. She's a beautiful girl, bro. For like, fat, slim, whatever. She's a beautiful girl, man. And you can see that at least she's making changes. She says she, she got pressed to train up. It's very expensive. To have, to have to go to the gym and to have a child and to do other 95 job is very difficult, okay? Um, but yeah, she did well. Um, she did clear points. Fantastic. Reva, she didn't talk a lot today. She, she didn't talk a lot today. I don't know she didn't talk a lot today, but you know the things that she says is always balanced and well thought about. Okay, um, Esther <laughs> talking about talking about losing weight. So she, fam, she she used Tommy talk. She talking to Tommy. She just talking to Tommy. Probably use waist trainer, waist divider. I don't know what it's like, but she made some valid points as well. I think she talked. Yeah, she made some valid, very valid points. And uh, who, who's who's next on the list? Um, is that other girl? The one with short hair. I forgot her name. But Azraya. Okay, I mean they all made valid points. There for noon. She, she, well, as why I also said that, yo, it is your fault, okay? But she understood that when it comes to literally things that, things that are outside what you can do, being in a medical condition, and stuff like that, it's not your fault, okay? But I never understood that. Everyone, everyone, it was a, it was a clear consensus between the whole audience, or I mean, between the whole cast, that it ultimately it is your fault, or well, except for Max, and Max was a little bit against it. It is your fault, okay? But uh, in terms of medical conditions, or what, or disorders, or traumas, then it's not your fault, or trauma. Trauma is not your fault, okay? Now, Biscuit... Well, Biscuit didn't say much. He, he's... That's Biscuit for you. Um, while he said a lot to be honest, he said that, yo, you know... Like, he's also trying to make a change as well. He mostly clocked him and looking himself in the mirror. like, yo, look at me now. He just has to make a change. I think all of us... And everyone else agreed, agreed on that consensus except for Max, who said that where your mum is big, your dad is big, like, not, that sometimes the child can be big as well. My mum was big. My dad is big. I was big. I change, you know? And I'm an adult, okay? So, at, at the end of the day... As an adult, it is your choice. You're a big man, you're a big girl, you're a big person. At your age, you, you should clock that you're the one to change for health issues. Not even for some people, they're, they're happy with it, but you have to think of the health issues, okay? When you're giving birth to children, you know, you want to be active with your child, you know? So when your child runs about, you want to be running about with him as well. When your child's like, Daddy, 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 and kicks the ball, you want to be able to run to it, you know, like, Son, how am I this? Oh, I'm tired. Daddy, just move two steps. I am tired. Let's go home. No pack today. You know, can't you want to be able to enjoy your children, your family. You know, being a being obese, okay, and the health condition that comes with it affects so much of your life, bro. So much of your life. I mean, for men, for men, them, okay. When you're obese, your thing gets smaller, okay. Let me let me go to the teeth because more fat covers it. You know, you know what I mean. Like, imagine it's imagine it's this, okay, and then you're slim, so it's like this, but. I know some of it is is um, genetics as well, okay. But then, as you're fat, more things cover it, cover it, cover it. Until you have to literally pull the thing down, and then you have to release the thing. That's that's how it is, okay. For girl, then when you're big, you're you're you're, you're obese. When I talk about obese, I mean obese, not BMI obese. Obese, or BMI obese is just overweight to me. When you're probably obese, obese. For a man to find the thing, yeah. Oh, move. I don't, you have to move the, the, the flaps out of the way. You divide it. And just say, I, I found it. I found it. I must enter now, kind of thing, you know. And then the thing swallows him and he dies. I mean, there's a woman that's 700 pounds. That's, that's obese, okay. 700, 700 pounds, okay. And she killed her son because she sat on him. Keep him fat. Hmm. Messed back here. And to be honest, fat, fat to me sounds like a swear word. Don't just me. Anyway, messed back here again with another video. Peace, love, and that. Uh, yeah.